Hey guys, I've had a few questions about how to turn in an assignment on Blackboard. Let's take a look at the project. On the main menu to the left, click on the project tab and to access the first assignment that's due, click on the set of instructions. It says assignment instructions, zero title selection, will open up a PDF document. You'll see you have three tasks each task has a short set of instructions and a small assignment. The first one is to read the instructions for the final project. Going back to the project page, click on Assignment Instructions, Final Project. Instead of giving you all of this project to do at once at the end of the semester, I wanted to really break it up. But before we get started, I need you to have an idea of the bigger picture for the whole assignment. So as you read through this whole assignment, don't get overwhelmed. Know that each of the areas of the outline will be divided over the course of the semester. And at the end of the semester, you will have already collected all of your information and will then plan to record a presentation using PowerPoint. If all of this is really overwhelming to you or you don't have experience using a camera on your phone or having never used PowerPoint, please contact the resources on campus. We have a great resource at MCC called the Center for Academic Excellence. If you go to the main page at MCC is www.mclennan.edu, hover over students, go to the Center for Academic Excellence. Here you'll find all of the contact information and the people here are really great at helping you work through the assignment. They have the recording equipment available to you and can also help you load your presentation onto YouTube. Again, these are all things that will be done towards the end of the semester. So let's go back to the assignment. So I have already created a file here. I've already done my assignment. I've put my name, which isn't totally necessary, but I've done each of the three points. Point one, point two, I chose my piece. Point three, please don't copy this. I've actually given you the work cited for a different book. This is not your textbook, but I do want you to cite your book as a source so that your work cited has already been started. Just save that as a file. As I go to save this, I'm gonna actually save it as a PDF. That's my preferred method of submission. So if you don't already know how to do that, if you'll go to this drop down menu when you save your file and select PDF and click save. And I've already done that, so I'm gonna replace it. And then the PDF file actually publishes on its own. I'm gonna close both of these and go back to submitting the assignment. I'm ready to submit my assignment. I've read the instructions. I've completed the assignment. So I'm gonna mark that I have reviewed the final project. Now it shows reviewed and I can see that you've read it. Then I'm gonna click on the title of the assignment. This is the submission page. So I wanna attach a file. See it says assignment submission, attach file. Go to browse my computer, I'm going to select the PDF file that I saved. You'll see it's here. And then at the bottom corner, somewhere, oh, at the top, I'm going to click submit. So you see my project has, or my assignment has loaded here. And you'll see a grade that's listed once I grade the actual assignment. Going back to the project page, you'll see that you have multiple outlines due throughout the semester which help you gather the information. I had a great question from a student. You are not required to add to your assignment collectively. You can save that on your own on your computer, but you only have to submit what's due to me in each outline title. I hope that makes sense. Please let me know if you have any questions. Have a great day. Thank <laughs> you.